Okay? You did this. Jeez. Okay? Yeah. This is what you get that was when you do that. The problem with this yeah. is going to kick you, and he's going to bend his elbow, he's going to walk right out of it. Okay? So when you get to here, wave. Now, I let go of this so that it wouldn't hurt him, okay? But that's what you get, okay? And it's not the steady pressure that's doing it. It's that sharp pulse. See any effect it has? Okay? That's waveforms. All right? And when you try and muscle these things, you're going to lose. Okay? Because otherwise they're not going to bother you. Does that make sense? So, all of these techniques. Uh, you've seen Kung Kong, right? Why is there? That's to tell you that's what's happening. <laughs> you know what I mean? <laughs> Do you understand? Yes. So these little twists that you see in your blocks and stuff like that, they're not for you to hit here. Okay? They're not for you to hit here. If you're just blocking with them, as the hand comes in, as the hand comes in, this twist is just to redirect it, okay? But when they're not supposed to be blocks, and most of the time they're not, the little twist is what's getting the nerve, okay? It's not, of course they do in the movies, <laughs> okay? If the little twist is what... <laughs> Yeah, it's a, it's a happy day for us all. When you <laughs> <laughs> the little twist is what actually does the work because when you activate the nerves, it's that sharp input coming out again that activates the nerve. The steady pulse does nothing. Okay, so these waveforms now are your way of activating those things in close. Does that make sense? Okay, and they'll work as I said with these types of things because the vibration always gets through. It's the same thing um, if I do this, resist. If I do this in one plane, the body knows how to deal with it. It's when you start moving the planes around that it has a hard time dealing with it. Okay, so.